Hey YouTube, Street Stomper here. Here's a follow-up video to my Something Is Happening video of the Durango. Um, as you can see, this is no longer a Durango. <laughs> I ended up changing my mind with the costs associated with doing what I wanted to do with that Durango. Um, I'm going to go ahead and tell you what the plan is. The plan is we're going to go out and do some family weekend excursions. And thought the Durango would kind of work for that. But... As I started, look, like I said, looking into the costs, it's not wasn't going to happen. Uh, just the bumper alone was almost three grand on that thing. So, and the lift, I can only get a three-inch lift for that. So at least with the F-150, I can go, you know, 35-inch tires easily. And just to be able to put all the gear in here, you know, in the canopy and keep it dry and still have our room inside the cab it just makes a little more sense um, and let's just face it it's a little bit more robust than a, a Durango right so yeah this is exactly how I picked it up um, I've done nothing to it brush guard was already on there running boards were already on there running boards are probably gonna come off uh, just simply because well they will get hung up on things but we'll see you know I'll probably just use it the way it is for now I want to get a couple winter camping trips in fairly sh soon, so yeah, so I thought uh, I should probably update on that, but yeah, it's a 2003 F-150 King Ranch, full load, it's got the um, rustic leather, I believe they call it, um, everybody seems to think it's dirty worn out leather, it's not, that's actually factory, um, I did put some seat covers on there just to protect it a little bit with getting dirty and whatnot so I've only had it for a week haven't put very many miles on it it's got the 5.4 liter v8 um, sunroof not that that matters canopy which is good because then we can put all our gear in the back and as you'll see I'm starting to acquire some more of the gear uh, I don't know why you need to see in there but just because so yeah stay tuned we are going to have lots of cool stuff coming up. Uh, like I said, we're going to do some winter camping with the family. And of course, throughout the summer and whatnot, we'll be doing a lot of trips with this thing. So stay tuned, YouTube.